Michael Fingleton has spoken publicly for the first time about his role in the banking crisis. The former Irish nationwide boss told RTE News he felt remorseful about how taxpayers were forced to bail out the building society. He was speaking at Dublin Airport on his return from Spain. The man who ran Irish Nationwide for more than three decades flew into Dublin from Spain. A day after it emerged, the building society's bailout will top €3 billion. Euro. Do you not have any sense of remorse about what's happened in Ireland as a result of what happened at banks like your own? Of course I have. Of course I have, like anybody else. I have indeed. And what do you think should be done? I, what do you think? What, everything is being done that possibly can be done. By everybody concerned. Do you feel guilty about oh, come on. what happened? Just I, I, I've already made my comment and that's it. I can't make I can't say anymore. Okay, thank you. Mr Fingleton, will you repay the one million euro bonus? I've already made a full statement of that. But you have received a lot of letters from Irish Nationwide Sorry? asking for the money I've back. I've already made a full public statement on that which you're fully aware of. Okay? And what about the loans to directors at, at uh, Anglo-Irish Bank. Do you regret your involvement with that in terms of the fact that those loans weren't made public to the direct to the shareholders of Anglo-Irish Bank? That, that's, a matter, that, that's a matter for the for the under investigation. Um, that will be made very clear, clear in due course that we had no no uh, responsibility whatsoever for those loans. Will you be cooperating with future investigations? I've, I've already cooperated and I continue to cooperate in every way I can. Despite his remorse, it's a simple fact that more than €3 billion, Euro, which is being put into Nationwide by taxpayers, will never be seen again. David Murphy, RT News, Dublin Airport.